The Yeezy 450 slides have a major problem. This is your last chance to get yourself a pair of the UNC Toe Air Jordan 1s. All you guys need to do is hit that thumbs up, hit that subscribe button right now, join the more family, leave a comment, let me know your size, DM me proof on Instagram, dannymore2369, take a picture, take a screenshot, send me proof that you guys subscribed here to my YouTube channel. Good luck, this is your last chance the winner will be in tomorrow's video on the jordan one low black toe so make sure you guys come back to the channel tomorrow to find out who won a free pair of unc toe air jordan ones good luck on the giveaway as you guys can tell i lost my voice at the drake concert the past few days i have not been able to talk this is the best i'm able to talk right now so please bear with me for this video hopefully i get my voice back sooner than later outright brands new collection for the jordan one low black toe just released today make sure you guys go cop the tees the shorts the hats for this release are straight fire make sure you guys check out outright brand with my link down below in the description and make sure you guys use my promo code danny moore to save 10 percent off your entire order outright brand makes clothing t-shirts shorts a bunch of clothing each and every week a sneaker releases well they're making clothing to go to match your sneakers make sure you guys check out outright brand the link is down below in the description thank you outright brand for sponsoring today's video if you guys can get this video up to 300 likes i'm gonna do a comparison video of the 450 yeezy slide and the regular yeezy slide that we all know and love and have been knowing and loving for the past few years so make sure you guys hit that thumbs up if you guys want me to do a comparison video starting off with the new box take a look at the box for the 450 slide it does have foam written at the top i did purchase these from goat instant ship they were not cheap at all for a pair of slides so please make sure you guys hit that thumbs up for me i spent over 250 dollars on this pair just to do some content so please make sure you guys hit that thumbs up and make sure you guys subscribe now take a look at the box label here's a look at the label i went to a size 12 here's why i did that i was not sure on sizing whatsoever because other yeezy slides the regular yeezy slides sizing's all over the place in some pairs i'm an 11 some pairs i'm a 12. in the 450 i did not want to even take the chance of going with the size 11 so i just went up a whole size to a size 12. With that being said, I did put these on feet. As you guys can see, I have them on feet outside. And I will say, I don't regret going to a 12. Could I have worn an 11? Yes, absolutely. So I would say go true to size on these. This particular color, the first pair, the cream colorway, I do recommend going true to size, which is a good thing to say because other Yeezy slides, the regular Yeezy slides, they're all over the place in sizing. So I definitely recommend going true to size in the 450 slide. At least right now, the cream colorway. Hopefully, if we do wind up getting more 450 slides, I'm not sure if we're going to. If we will, hopefully Adidas can keep the sizing the way it is on this particular colorway. True to size, in my opinion. I did get a 12. Do I regret it? No, I'm still going to make it work. I'm still going to wear them, enjoy them. I will say they are definitely loud, right? They're definitely out there. You do have a whole caged upper and it's see-through completely. So I do recommend, of course, wearing socks with these. I would not personally not wear Yeezy slides without socks. I need socks on my Yeezy slides, but I will say this, they're comfortable. This foam is very comfortable and it reminds me so much, it's basically the same as the regular Yeezy slide foam. The only thing I do notice, in my opinion, is that I feel a little bit lower to the ground in these than a traditional regular Yeezy slide. And that could be because of the grooves. You guys see the bottom, how it's kind of grooved down there, and then you have all the pattern there. I think that might be why, because you're not really flat to the ground as much as the regular Yeezy slide. So I do recommend going true to size. They are extremely comfortable you know yeezys are known for being very comfortable shoes and the slides here the new 450 slides are no exception they fit right in with the rest of the yeezys as far as comfortability as far as materials you can bend them you could squish them they're going to be very easy to clean which is a good sign this particular colorway is nice i like it a lot it is cream 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 right across the board more like a butter color a yellowish color a goldish color so i'm a huge fan 
I think it's a really good slide. As I continue to wear them, if you guys would like, I could do a wear test video on these because I will be putting a lot, and I mean a lot of wear into these very soon. I could use a new pair of slides. So, hey, these might be my new go-to slides right now, and I could do a wear test video. If you guys would like to see that, please leave a comment and make sure you guys get this video up to 300 likes. Hit that thumbs up if you haven't done so already, and make sure you guys subscribe and hit that notification bell. Please make sure you guys hit the bell. As far as branding goes, of course, minimal branding. We just have the Adidas logo there on the back. On the inside, it does say 450 slide. It's embossed in there. It says 450 slide and made in China, which is a little bit disappointing to see. I was hoping that these would be made in the States, but that's just not the case, but it is what it is. So I will say this, they definitely are comfortable. As far as foam runners, maybe I could do a comparison video, if you guys would like, of the 450 slides against the foam runners. I've worn the foam runners and the slides so much. Let me know what you guys think about the 450 slide here in the cream colorway. I'm not sure if we're gonna receive more colorways. Hopefully we do. I don't want this to be a one and done, but who knows what's going on with that. So I will say these are very, very dope. I'm a huge fan. Very, very out there and loud. Definitely loud. When you're wearing the Yeezy 450 slide, you see this upper where your foot goes into. I feel like you have more room here than you do on the actual Yeezy slides, the other Yeezy slides. So that's definitely nice to see. You have more room to actually put your foot in. And that might be why they also fit true to size as well. Because regular Yeezy slides for the most part are a little tight. These, no man, you have a very, very big wide opening to put your foot in, which is nice. If you're buying the 450 slides, I do recommend going true to size. And I recommend wearing them, putting miles on them. I think you're really gonna enjoy them with this foam material. Guys, they're amazing. It's just another good, easy, wearable, everyday throw on shoe, just like the regular Yeezy slides, as well as the foam runners. So it's nice to add something new, in my opinion, here to the mix, to the collection. I'm here for it. The Yeezy 450 slide cream is fire, straight fire. If you guys are buying these, please let me know down below in the comments. Comment a bunch of fire emojis. If you're gonna pass completely on these, Please comment a bunch of trash emojis. I want to see who's going to buy the Yeezy 450 cream slide and who's not. The big problem with these, I would say, is sizing. I know it's going to throw a lot of people off because a lot of people go up in Yeezys. Well, in my opinion, you can go true to size and that might be a good sign for the future if they decide to make more of these. So make sure you guys go true to size and make sure you guys check out the 450 slide. If you like these, I think they're fire and I'm excited to wear them. I wanna thank you guys so much for watching. Make sure you guys enter in the UNC toe giveaway. Make sure you guys come back to the channel tomorrow. The giveaway winner will be in the video on the black toe lows. I wanna thank you guys so much for watching. Make sure you guys join the more family. Hit that subscribe button, smash that like button. We're always on the grind, we're never gonna stop. Always dropping that fire. Straight fire. Thank you guys so much for watching. We out.